show. Thank you for coming. us that some people only do things they are comfortable with, and some people try new things. <laughs> That's so true. It's important to try new things as much as you can.
Disney Studios first feature flight in a film was Snow White in the Seven Doors and it debuted in 1937. The Disney Studios' first airline animated film was Snow White and the Seven Doors, and it debuted in 1937. At the premiere, the crowd gave a standing ovation after it was released to the public. It earned $8 million in the box office, most made by any film up to that time. Moana also received a standing ovation, but specifically for its music by Lynn Manuel Miranda. Here's one of her favorites from the movie We Know the Way. In comparison, Disney released Moana in 2016. It made $690 million. Wow. Wow, that's a big difference.
Thank you to our wonderful kindergarten teachers, Miss Asher, Miss Cohera, Miss Marsh, and Miss Pearson.
stuck in my head for five months. <laughs> Good to get it out. Uh, if you're just now joining us, thank you. It is a Disney theme, as you've probably figured out. Um, and thank you for coming tonight. We're really appreciative of having you here. Um, we have over 50 volunteers here tonight. If you are a volunteer and you're in the room, you might not be here in here with us, uh, but we'd like to give you a round of applause, volunteers. I also see many uh, students and family members wearing our HPS Music Apparel. That's a fundraiser. Um, our first month we raised $870, and to date we raised over $10,000. That, of course, has been spent pretty quickly, just starting a new music program. Uh, that brings me to my second point. Um, we are accepting any donations of any musical instrument in any condition, and we will pay for your repairs so that I can put that into the hands of a new band student. So if you have a trumpet or a flute that is just sitting in your basement or that you haven't touched for a long time, and you'd like to pass that down, I'd like to pay for your repairs so that we can give that to a student. If you're interested, just contact me uh, when you can. Thank you. Abby, take it away. Wow, Peter Guest sure has a lot of words. We love learning new words in the music room. Speaking of new words, there is a tongue twister from the 1967 movie, The Jungle Book. Have you heard of it? But I've always 
love the idea of summer and sun and all things hot. Really? I'm guessing you don't have much experience with heat. Nope, but sometimes I like to close my eyes and imagine what it will be like when summer does come. Ah. Walt Disney was an American motion picture and TV producer and, and a showman who had lots of imagination, energy, and um, magical humor. develop well-loved amusements for children of all ages throughout the world. Walt Disney cartoon characters such as Mickey Mouse and Donald Duck. He also planned to Disneyland, a huge amusement park that opened near Los Angeles in 1955. Before his death, he began building a second such park, Walt Disney World, near Orlando, Florida. Raise your hand if you've been to either park. Right now, after our last song, 
you can pick them up in the small gym, which is located down this hallway. There's lots of signs and volunteers to help you out. Thank you, and please enjoy our last song.
from short from short films with Mickey Mouse to big screen hits with Ariel and Sebastian, Disney has always been imaginative and innovative in what the world needs to see and hear. That curiosity has changed pop culture forever. Many of Disney's messages have been portrayed in the music. Walter Elias Disney once said, we keep moving forward, opening new paths, and doing new things because we're curious and curiosity leads us down new paths. Man, that quote was amazing. No. It was great. No, I know what it was. It was supercalifragilisticexpialidocious.
fetched all sat on Jim's shelf in Treasure Island. You can see Aladdin's magic carpet fell from Beauty and the Beast and Pooba from the Lion King on the streets surrounding Notre Dame during the out there scene in the Hunchback of Notre Dame. My favorite is when Rapunzel and Flynn appear at Elsa's coronation in Frozen and Pinocchio sitting up in the rafters during Flynn Rider's I've Got a Dream scene. Did you know at the beginning of every Disney movie, Tinkerbell flies over Cinderella's castle? She also appears among the fairies in the Black Cauldron. Speaking of flying, Aladdin's magic carpet can be seen in the opening scene of the movie, The Princess and the Frog. Can you imagine flying around a city on a magic carpet exploring a whole new world? Here's what it might sound like.
Thank you again for attending our show. Uh, if I did not thank you, thank you. Uh, uh, we have Nancy LaBianca doing video up top. We have Thomas Kearney running sound. Um, we have Mr. Q, who's our event staff and custodian tonight. Um, every teacher who helped, every volunteer, all of our Disney princesses, and Olaf, since he's not a princess. Um, thank you very much for coming. We do have one final song for you tonight. When the show is over, you can get your student in the small gym and then head on home. And thank you so much for a great night. Here's our final song. Thank you. Have a wonderful night. Please drive safely. And we want to thank Mrs. Lennon.